Hey there, everyone. My name is Nathan, and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services with their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now, here with us today, we have a Barnes & Noble Nook 10-inch HD tablet. So this is a device that runs Android, and it's actually built by Lenovo for Barnes & Noble to use as their as one of their Nook tablets. And so this is also known as a Lenovo Tab M10 HD. So Lenovo builds these tablets for use by their own customers, but then they also have this special version that then has the Nook software loaded onto it for use with Barnes & Noble services. But underneath it is all still an Android device, and so it does have the Google Account Lock security feature built into it. And that feature has been activated on this specific device because as we're going through here, we get to the screen that tells us that the device was reset. And to continue, we have to sign in with a Google account that was previously on it in order to continue and get through the rest of the setup process. So over the years, we've been contacted by tons of customers asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information after having done a factory reset, or because they purchased the device used from a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the device was locked. But at any rate, we're now making this video here to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this exact model without having to have the previous user's login information. It's something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection. And we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet to perform the exact same procedure that we did here with this one. So actually before starting the video, we had already done 99% of the work necessary to remove the lock just so we can keep the video as short as possible. We just left the lock up in place right before the last step so that you guys could all see that the device was indeed locked so that you know that this isn't a trick. We're not trying to scam anyone here that you can see for yourselves with visual proof that we can indeed perform this service. So now that the final step has been completed, we should now be able to see that we can get all the way through the initial setup steps to the home screen without running into that Google lock page. So now that the tablet has been restarted, we're gonna go through step by step here, starting with all of the Lenovo terms and conditions there. And then in regards to Wi-Fi, we actually don't need that anymore. So I'm just gonna tap set up offline because it'll help us get through the setup faster. And then we have to read and agree to Google services. And we're not gonna put a screen lock on the device, so that is just gonna get skipped. And we're not gonna do a system update that it was prompting for, because we just wanna get through this as fast as we can. Okay, and then we can tap finish device setup and we should Yep, there we go. We've got the main software all starting to load up here. And then once we let's see, we'll just skip the the whole sign in thing. There we go. Just to verify that we can access the main home screen. There we go. We've got everything starting to load up, all the apps and settings and features, and it is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, I'm going to go ahead and pop into the settings just to verify exactly which model we have here. So when we go to system and then about tablet, so it does indeed show up at the top here as a Lenovo tab m10 hd and then farther down we have the exact model number here the tbx306f 
So again, that's Lenovo's specific tablet here that also has the Nook software loaded on it. So if you have one of these Nook tablets that has the Google Lock enabled and need help getting it removed, we would love to assist you with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact info will be right down in the video description, and we'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of our info there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of models of mobile devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.